at the 32nd MSPO 2024 in Poland, Hangwa Defiance showcased the Aerion Smet, a cutting-edge 6x6 unmanned ground vehicle that has garnered significant attention in the global defense market. This unveiling follows a major milestone for the vehicle, a successful completion of a foreign comparative test conducted by the U.S. Marine Corps and the U.S. Army. This test not only highlighted the Aerion Smet's advanced capabilities, but also positioned it as a strong contender in the competitive UGV market, particularly in the United States. The Aerion Smet's participation in the U.S. Department of Defense FCT program marks the first time a South Korean UGV has been selected for such evaluation. This program, designed to assess and validate technologies developed by defense contractors from allied nations. The Aerion SMET, which stands for Autonomous and Robotic Systems for Intelligence Off-Road Navigation, Small Multi-Purpose Equipment Transport, is a fully electric 6x6 UGV designed to support a wide range of military operations. The vehicle boasts a maximum payload capacity of 550 kg and can travel up to 100 km on a single charge. It achieves top speed of 43 km per hour on paved roads, making it highly versatile across different operational environments. One of the standout features of the Aerion SMAT is its remote control weapon system, which can be equipped with a 5.56mm machine gun, upgradable to a 7.62mm version. The remote control weapon system is capable of automatically tracking and targeting threats by detecting gunfire, enhancing the vehicle's combat effectiveness in hostile environments. The vehicle's autonomous capabilities are equally impressive. It is designed for off-road navigation and can autonomously follow or lead soldiers and vehicles using a tethering device. In the event of communication loss, the Aerion SMAT can autonomously return to its base, ensuring mission continuity. Additionally, its software supports manned and unmanned teaming operations, enabling seamless integration with human and robotic assets in tactical scenarios. The Aaron Smith's successful completion of the foreign comparative test with the U.S. Marine Corps and Army has opened doors for its potential deployment within these branches. If adopted, it could play a critical role in enhancing the mobility and operational capabilities of infantry units, particularly in complex environments where traditional manned vehicles may be less effective. The vehicle's deployment is not limited to the United States. South Korea, as the developer of the Aerion SMAT, is likely to be one of its primary operators. The vehicle's design lies with the needs of the South Korean military, which faces unique challenges due to the Korean Peninsula's varied terrain and the ongoing tensions with North Korea. The Aerion's mass ability to operate autonomously in difficult terrains and its support for a range of military operations make it a valuable asset for South Korea's defense strategy. Beyond South Korea and the United States, the Aeron SMAT has significant export potential. Its participation in the FCT program serves as a strong endorsement of its capabilities, likely attracting interest from other allied nations seeking to enhance their ground forces with advanced unmanned systems. Countries with a focus on modernizing their military equipment, 
particularly those operating in environments similar to the FCT test conditions, may find the Arians met an appealing option. As Martin warfare increasingly relies on advanced technologies and unmanned systems, the Arians met is well positioned to become a key player in this evolving landscape. Its combination of autonomous capabilities, robust design, and versatility across various military applications makes it a valuable tool for modern armies. Whether used for reconnaissance, munitions transport, medical evacuation, or direct combat support, the Arian SMAT provides a flexible and reliable solution to the challenges of contemporary military operations. The vehicle's potential for integration into manned and manned teaming operations further enhances its utility, allowing it to operate alongside manned vehicles and infantry units, providing critical support in real time. As defense focuses throughout the world continue to adapt to the demands of modern warfare, the Arians met is likely to see increased deployment and adoption solidifying its place in the future of military operations. In conclusion, the Arian SMAT's debut at MSPO 2024 and its successful FCT evaluation highlight its advanced capabilities and strong market potential. As Hangwa Defense continues to develop and refine this innovative UGV, the Arian SMAT is poised to play a significant role in the modernization of military forces worldwide, offering a powerful combination of mobility, protection, and autonomous functionality.